this video will be discussing a series resonant inverters. A series resonant inverter is an electrical inverter whose operation is based on oscillation of resonant current. Yet the switching device and the resonating components are connected in series to each other. As a result of the natural features of this circuit, the current passing through the switching device drops to zero. This, this type of inverter yields a sinusoidal waveform at very high frequencies. The frequency set, which is resonance, is a peak. Now, this frequency is in the range of 20 kHz to 100 kHz. It is therefore most suitable for applications that demand a fixed output, such as induction heating and a fluorescent light. It is usually small in size because its switching frequency is high. So the, this is a general rule of thumb in power electronics. If your switching frequency is high, the size of the components will be lower. So this is a diagram of uh, a series resonant inverter. Here you can see that when the switch S1, T1, so the switch T1 conducts, the series resonant circuit is formed here. And the resonance is created and power is transferred. Similarly, uh, when the switch T2 is switched on, then a series resonance circuit on the lower side is formed and we get the maximum power on the lower side. So this is how the series resonant uh, inverter works. This is the half of series resonant inverter. So there is another series resonant uh, inverter circuit here which is the three switches. Now this is the topology with the three switches S1, S2 and S3. Now uh, this, these are the waveforms. So in the first time uh, when the S1 is on, the switch is S2 is off and VGS3 is on. So these two switches S1 and S3 are now conducting. So due to this uh, conducting, due to this conduction, the power is transferred like this. So this, this is the behavior of the voltage field like this. Now for the next for this uh, other uh, time period we have VGS1. For the other time slot we have VGS1 off, VGS2 on and VGS3 on. So these two switches are now conducting. So now the circuit is like this. So in this way, the uh, power is uh, negative resonance is created, and that is why we get the negative field here. Here. So now on the, the next uh, time field, you can see that the VGS1 is on, or VGS2 is on, and VGS3 is also on. Now this switch is off. When this switch is off, you will be having on this switch is power supply and now the capacitor will be charged. You can see that the charging of the capacitor. The capacitor is getting charged with one switch on the S1. S1 is on. This time frame on the S1 is on. On the next time slot, that is from 3 pi to 4 pi, we can see VGS1 is on. But VGS2 is on and VGS3 is also on. Now, now in this case, this charged capacitor will then get discharged. So you can see that the capacitor gets discharged. So this is the, this is the these are the waveforms for the series resonant inverter with the three switches. So this is all about uh, resonant uh, resonant inverters for the course. Thank you very much for listening.